Nothing serious, Pastor. A little bit dirt, maybe. It's been losing five seconds a day. Maybe a good cleaning. Mm, fine. You can do it now. While I'm here, it really would be most helpful. Yeah. Good. I'll go up and have a chat with your papa. I hear he's been wearing a Jewish star. Stubbornness is the child of pride, and pride is the first of the seven deadly sins. I'll speak to him about it. So I need to be back at the church by 1.30. It will be ready. Dr. Heemstra. Mr. Ball, I can only stay for a moment. milk for him, not soup. Good Lord, you don't intend to keep it. But you can't. It's illegal. You could all be arrested. He's beautiful. <laughs> Pastor. The Lord must have sent you here. You live in the country. Nothing could be safer. It's impossible. I, I, I have my own family to think of. We could lose everything for that child. Where would my church be without a shepherd? Oh, but... No, Betsy. The pastor has decided it is the law. And Christians must obey the law. Think what you are risking for the sake of one Jewish baby. And will you report us, Pastor, if the baby must stay a while with us? Corey, we are meant to obey the law of this state if it does not go against a higher law of God. Pastor, you want me to take off my star. Very well. I will not wear it. And we will keep the child. As a Christian, I am sorry when any man must suffer. No matter who he is. What his race. But remember, it is the Jews who gave us the Bible and our savior. It is on your heads. I'll pick up my watch tomorrow. Good day, Tenbom. Ladies. God forgive him. He did not mean it. How can that man call himself a Christian? If a mouse lives in the cookie jar, that doesn't necessarily make him a cookie. <laughs> 